Lord, this is Prophet Score back out here on the beachfront. It is a cool, about 70 degrees out here. Um, the wind is strong, the waves are high, and people are actually in the water surfing. But what I come out here today for was to encourage you. Once again, um, when I woke up this morning, the spirit of condemnation was heavy in my spirit. So sometimes we gotta look at those things because people will condemn you over something that happened 30, 40 years ago. And God is saying to his children that there is now, therefore, no. Can you repeat after me? No condemnation to those who walk in the spirit and not after the flesh. So if you have been being condemned over something from your past, that's the best the enemy got here to come back at you from something you did 20, 30, 40, 50 years ago. You tell that devil there is now, therefore, no condemnation against me. God is saying, if you change your thoughts, you can change your life. Because oftentimes, what we always are thinking about is stressing us out. Although somebody said something to us 20, 30 years ago, and if you wake up and you wonder where that thought come from, God has said that's a stronghold. You need to pull that thing down, rebuke the devil in the name of Jesus, because there is no weapon formed against you that will ever be able to prosper. So if you can change your thoughts, change your attitudes, you change your life, you will not become what your thoughts dictate to you if they are negative. You can be all that God said that you are. You can be empowered. You can be blessed. You can be... Uh, on top and not the bottom. You can be in front and not in the back. God said you control your destiny about the way you think. So if you got negative thinking, turn that thing around into a positive thought and become what God has called you to be. You do not have to be what the enemy declares you to be. Amen. Amen. God bless you.